Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick Nanji. I'm really excited to make this video for you because we're going to a very special location. We're going to go visit Jackie Coogan. I'll get into who he is, but I'll tell you a couple of things before that. I just came to get a haircut, so I'm out of the haircut place. I didn't even, I like to go get a haircut and then like shower and, and, and prim and stuff. So if you happen to see any hairs, any wayward hairs, that's what happened. So anyway, Jackie Coogan is known as one of the first child actors in cinema history. He was known as the kid in uh, Charlie Chaplin's The Kid Movie. He was a little boy. He grew up and he became, uh, well, he played Uncle Fester in the original Adams Family 1960s. He was a great actor, fantastic. It's hard to imagine that it's the same person, but yes, it is. Um, he was also primarily responsible for the Coogan Act. You may have heard that. That is a lot of the uh, protections and regulations to protect children and their money uh, so that they doesn't get taken away by their parents or people who are their parents slash guardians. Um, in fact, his parents, his blood parents, um, pretty much took his entire fortune from him. And he had to go to court and, and, and figure all that out. And I don't believe he recuperated a lot of it, but he left that legacy of being able to, um, you know, protect future child actors. So Macaulay Culkin, all those kids now benefit from that law. He was also a decorated veteran. He was a pilot. And so, I mean, this man was so talented, so amazing. And uh, yeah, we're going to go visit him at a cemetery that, in fact, my grandmother and great-grandmother are buried at. So we'll take a look at that, maybe stop by there and go visit this wonderful man. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't want to waste what's left And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on and on we'll go You know, I haven't been here to see my grandma in a while it's the day after Christmas and I'm like I need to be here and visit and I don't know as soon as I got through like I got a little emotional because I don't know my grandma was really special to me uh, my great grandma as well but I was so close to my grandma so long has gone by it's uh, seven years and I feel like I've got so much that I want to like catch her up on and everything so I appreciate all of you for coming on this journey with me to go visit but don't worry we'll go see Jackie right after this no, I don't Someone actually dug a little right over here. Oh, and her plant fell. Ooh, I'll fix it. There we go. People have music. There's, I think, a burial going on over there. But yeah, oh, and it's dripping wet. It's my grandma. She was, she taught me so much about what love is and how to love someone and uh, I don't know apparently the same person brought this here because this is buried here and this is here and I don't know whose this is but I will fix it for them yeah so I appreciate you coming down and visiting with me as I'm walking back Oh, it's not that hard to do. I thought it would be difficult to do walking back to the car. It means a lot to me that you watch this part of the video. I'm very private, believe it or not. I'm a very private person. And it means a lot that you've come with me to share in this experience. Now we're going on to see Jackie. I'm so excited. I've never come and visited him before, so let's go take a look. People sometimes ask me why come to cemeteries of strength, but I mean, look at this. So beautiful. Beautiful little lake here. It's lovely. And 
now I gotta go. I'm at the, uh... On this side now. There's a beautiful grotto over here, and this is where Jackie's buried. We're on the west side now. My grandmother and the plots over there are more on the south side. And so, I mean, you can't miss this. Huge grotto, look at this. It's gorgeous. It's a bit of a hill. It's a bit of a trek. We'll stop over here. And there's a Pieta, which is Mary and holding the deceased Jesus. And that's where we're gonna go. So if you ever come to visit Jackie Coogan, remember it's on the leftmost street, and this is the statue I wanna look at, so we'll head there. So as we approach this beautiful statue, there are more actors and actresses, really famous people buried here. If you want me to go visit them, uh, please let me know, and I'd be more than happy uh, to do so. I just want to come and see this beautiful, beautiful statue here. Look at that. So nice. And people have left stuff for Christmas, of course. Now the thing is, Jackie's in this area over here. I'm not exactly where, so we're gonna have to do a little bit of a treasure hunt. And we're looking, I'm obviously trying to walk in areas that are more respectful, so I'm not stepping on areas where I don't need to be stepping on. And uh, there's a couple that I saw that stood out, but not yet. I must have passed it, guys and gals, because I have Pat O'Brien listed here. And apparently, not too far away is Jackie. So, still looking here. It's, it's not easy to find people, <laughs> let me tell you. I've never in my life, guys and gals, had such a difficulty finding someone at a cemetery. And uh, I'm going to find him. I know. I am very close. I'm in the right area. There's no markers except for all flat gravestones. The years are accurate. I have a photo roughly showing where it is that I'm using as a reference point. Uh, but it is not easy. I've been here at least 20 minutes. Easily. Easily 20 minutes looking, literally going grave by grave. Uh, but I will find them. All right, guys and gals, I've been here almost 30 minutes trying to find Jackie Coogan, but to my relief, I was able to find him. I honestly thought he was under this, but I, I literally went all the way over here, all around, back and forth. I almost went to the end, and then I went back almost to the palm tree, and I did it like two or three times. And I said, well, he can't be under this, because I don't know what's, and then I see John, he's known as John, Leslie Coogan. I have to lift this up. Okay, I have to lift this up just to show you guys um, that this is him. Humanitarian patriot and entertainer forever in our hearts. 1914, 1984. I just want to be respectful. I don't want to get in trouble or anything. Uh, but yeah, here he is. I've come so far and I can tell you I was all around. I was over here at this grave so much looking, knowing that the perspective was here. And uh, I'm happy to be able to find the real first Uncle Fester over here. Again, I apologize, they have that on there for a reason. Probably the grave next door or next to it. Um, it is a little unsightly. I apologize. It kind of is what it is, honestly, guys and gals. But yes, this is this is Jackie, Jackie Coogan, our our favorite Uncle Faster. Very, very cool. As always, I bring my thoughts. I bring um, all my prayers of you guys here, because um, he was uh, a man who went through a lot, like maybe some of us, and so we can relate to that. Um, obviously a World War II veteran, hero, entertainer, humanitarian. I find that, I don't even want to touch that because someone left that there respectfully, but humanitarian. Um, he obviously did a lot of good for many people and that was first 
Then we have Patriot and then Entertainer. That's how I feel. His family wanted to remember him. So thank you, Jackie. Thank you, John. And uh, hopefully this was a wonderful experience to be able to be here and uh, spend a little time with Jackie. So as I am again walking back to my car, um, I got so frustrated trying to find Jackie and I couldn't and I went to see another star that I'll bring you soon in another video I'm sure. Um, but then I came back and I didn't want to give up. I kind of started fresh in about 25 other minutes, I don't know, a good 10 minutes and then another 25, 30 minutes to find him. But it was worth it bringing him to you guys. Before I leave, I have to show this to you. I was in my car doing my outro, and this caterpillar out of nowhere pulled up right where I was, okay? I, I bet you he was waiting for me. He was, they were probably, they know when people are on the grounds and they don't do it when people are around, but this, I swear I did not see that thing pull up right now as I'm about to leave. And that man there is cleaning some of the uh, grave sites, and it just comes to show that this place is always uh, taking care of the people here. I thought I wanted to include that in there here for you. All right, guys and gals, I hope this was as special to you as it was to me. It really was. Part of the fun and excitement is looking out for these individuals and um, who've touched us in our lives. At least most of these individuals that I love never knew me, never going to know me if they're alive, most likely. Um, but it's incredible to think that you know, their life here on earth has ended, but they continue to bring us joy and happiness and make us feel all these wonderful things. So I appreciate you coming on here. If you want to see more videos like this, in fact, the one that I visited uh, right before finding Jackie, I can make another video on him. I would be so happy to do so. I think one that you would really, really, really love, especially being a follower of this channel. Let me know in the comments below. Thumbs up the video, subscribe. It all helps out. It's all absolutely free. It takes a couple seconds. It's a beautiful act of kindness. It does help out my channel. It does help me stay on to continue making videos like this, um, continue bringing you this content uh, for the entire family. All right, we'll see you next time, guys and gals, and don't forget, be hopeful. Thanks as always to all the Patreon supporters, especially the executive producers for this video. Andy B, David D, Ricky, and Joe R. Thank you so much to everyone.